Charles McCarry is an American writer, primarily of spy fiction. Early life. His family is from the Berkshires area of western Massachusetts, where he currently lives. Career. Military and correspondence McCarry served in the United States Army, where he was a correspondent for Stars and Stripes, and he has been a small-town newspaper man. As an editor and writer, McCarry was editor-at-large for National Geographic and has contributed pieces to the New York Times, the Wall Street Journal, the Washington Post, and other national publications. His novels are currently published by Overlook Press, starting with Tears of Autumn. Charles N. Brown, the publisher of Locus, which primarily addresses the science fiction publishing world, wrote in the July 2006 issue, two Charles McCarry hardcover, a reprint from Overlook, aren't really SF a fantasy, but they are two of the best spy thrillers ever written and form a secret or alternate history of the 20th century. McCarry is best known for a series of books concerning the life of super spy Paul Christopher, notable for their historical detail and depiction of spycraft, as well as their careful and extensive examination of Christopher's relationship with his family, friends, wives, and lovers. Born in Germany before World War II, to a German mother and an American father, Christopher joins the CIA after serving as a first lieutenant in the U.S. Marine Corps. In the war Christopher fought in the Battle of Okinawa, where he received the Silver Star and the Purple Heart. He becomes one of the agency most effective spies. After launching an unauthorized investigation of the Kennedy assassination, Christopher becomes a pariah to the agency and a hunted man. Eventually, he spends 10 years in a Chinese prison before being released and embarking on a solution to the mystery that has haunted him in his entire life, the fate of his mother, who disappeared at the beginning of World War II. Also notable are two books dealing with Paul Christopher's American cousins, Horace and Julian Hubbard, The Better Angels and Shirley's Heart. These novels tell the story of a U.S. president who approves the assassination of the leader of an oil-rich Arab nation who has acquired nuclear arms and intends to pass them on to a terrorist organization. When news of this threatens to ruin the president's chances for re-election, the Hubbards conspire to steal the election. In Shelley's heart, the conspiracy is revealed, and the newly re-elected president is impeached and placed on trial in the Senate. Both books indicate McCarry's extensive knowledge of Washington politics. McCarry's most unusual book in the series, also concerning the Christopher family, is Bride of the Wilderness. Set in the 17th century, it's an historical romance concerning one of Paul Christopher's ancestors, the English-born Fanny Harding. After her father's death, Fanny travels to America, is abducted by Indians during the French-Indian Wars, and eventually marries one of her captors, a French officer named Philippe de Saint-Christophe. McCarry has also written several standalone novels. The most recent of these is The Shanghai Factor. Publishers Weekly says, Meticulous, intelligent prose is the real star of this excellent espionage thriller. McCarry focuses more on the psychological challenges faced by street-level agents and those running the operations than on physical action. Adaptations in other media the film Wrong is Right, starring Sean Connery, was loosely based on McCarry's novel The Better Angels. Influences McCarry is an admirer of the work of W. Somerset to Maugham, especially the Ashenden stories. He was also an admirer of Richard Condon, author of The Manchurian Candidate, Prizzy's Honor, and numerous other novels, books, novels featuring Paul Christopher and his family. In terms of reading sequence, the events in The Secret Lovers come after the Mirnik dossier and before the tears of autumn. Despite the publication sequence, those who wish to follow the events in order should thus read The Secret Lovers before reading The Tears of Autumn. The Mirnik dossier, Christopher investigates a possible Soviet spy in Geneva. The Tears of Autumn, Christopher investigates the Kennedy assassination.
The Secret Lovers, Christopher discovers a secret plot within the CIA. The Better Angels, Christopher's cousins steal a presidential election. The Last Supper, Introduction to Christopher's parents in pre-World War II Germany, Christopher is imprisoned in China. The Bride of the Wilderness, Historical Novel, Concerning 17th Century Christopher Ancestors. Second Sight, Released from a Chinese Prison, Christopher meets a daughter he did not know he had. Shelley's Heart, sequel to The Better Angels. Christopher's cousins cause a presidential impeachment. Old Boys, Christopher's old associates discover a plot involving terrorists and the fate of Christopher's mother. Christopher's Ghosts, the story of Christopher's first love in pre-World War II Germany. Other novels Lucky Bastard, a comic novel in which a likable but amoral, devious, and oversexed politician is controlled by a female Eastern Bloc subversive. Ark, Earth's wealthiest man attempts to save humanity from a coming apocalypse. The Shanghai Factor, The Mulberry Bush, Nonfiction Citizen Nader, Double Eagle, Ben Abruzzo, Maxi Anderson, Larry Newman, The Great Southwest, Ales of the Caribbean, For the Record, From Wall Street to Washington, Paths of Resistance, The Art and Craft of the Political Novel, Inner Circles, How America Changed the World, a memoir, From the Field, a collection of writings from National Geographic.